could official. Afternoon, everybody. It is 1.30 p.m. We have received a third notice. Not one, not two, but three. Third notice from the school saying that Silas cannot continue school if he doesn't have his paperwork. So, I'm on it today. thing that the school needs is the report for health examination, so medical and dental and he's already had a physical done. He has a clean bill of health, so that's why I've continued to send him. He's not a risk to other children there. And then his oral one was a little bit blah. I kind of messed up. I made an appointment for the time that I thought I made the appointment, which was two o'clock, which isn't like me to make an appointment for my kids at two o'clock, because that would mean that I would pull all three of them out to take him to the dentist. But long story short, I showed up at three o'clock and they were like, yeah, your appointment was at two. So, super long story short, his dentist appointment along with the twins was rescheduled and I finally got him in last week. So now, since that form is filled out, I can take it over to the school, which is what I'm going to do now. But I just want to double check to make sure that everything on here is filled out. And then I'm going to take me a little walk today because it's a beautiful day for it. I'm feeling like a very responsible adult today. Not only have I filled out this form, taken my kids to the doctor's appointments and the dentist appointments, I'm even taking a walk to go drop this off without my hair done. That's okay. Trying to fake cough. Ooh. No, that was a real cough. But now I'm done with my reading. Okay. Mm, okay. Yeah. Mommy. Yes. I'm just going to get a three. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get a three. So you can have three, four, five. Wow, you did it. Good job. Is that a sunflower seed right here on the floor? Mm -hmm. I'll take it. One. Oh. We have the cleanest bubby I ever did see. How's your lip? Mm, it looks a lot better than it did. I think it helped a little bit. I like your towel. Mm. Yeah. <coughs> Clearly. Let me see. I know you're cold, but go wipe your hair. Everything you see. You're cold, huh? I'll wipe your noggin. So Silas, how are you feeling now? I want to get out of here. You want to get out of here? Let me wipe your face. Miss your lips. Don't do that. Don't be obnoxious. Look down a little bit. Yeah, he looks a little bit better. So. Oh. Silas is starting to feel better. He actually wasn't like, 
he was okay majority of the time. What do you think? I think just when all of it happened, it was startling for him. And there was like a good chunk of blood that scared you, huh, buddy? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that good chunk of blood. So he's... He didn't want to go to soccer practice, which in the beginning I was like, no, buddy, it's your last soccer practice. You need to go. Um, and he only has... He only has one soccer practice a week and his games this Saturday. So I was like, no, you need to go. But then like the more that I thought about it, I was like, I'm going to make him go. And he's going to end up getting knocked in the face with a ball. And that would have been just horrible. Can you do me a favor? Don't suck on your lip. So he didn't go to soccer practice, but oh, we'll be starting to go there. Why? It's okay. Because those weren't, no, it's okay. Those aren't PJs anyway, so that's fine. You can wear that. Anyway, I keep getting interrupted, but he is fine. He's, um, PJs, that's where they are. We moved a few things around in Silas's room, and I don't know where any of his stuff is. So, no, this, wear this one, yep, perfect. You're going to have two shirts on? Oh my gosh, you're going to look adorable. Open that back up. <laughs> I don't know what you when you edit you'll see what Yeah, I was like, I don't know what all y'all have seen so far in the back, but look closely. Here, here buddy. That's gonna be I'm sorry when I'm editing, I'm sorry for what y'all are gonna be seeing. Or you're welcome. I don't know what it is. Match a pencil to your homeless. All right, you guys have free time. Go find something to do. Have fun. I've had sky pen. The boys having downtime means I get one and two laundry baskets that are empty. But I'll be honest with you guys, it's not completely empty. I kind of made a small little pile here with like some socks that I need to match. I can't. This is my sock. Actually, I'm just going to. Oh, another one of these bad babies. I think. The other one might be in here. It's not really common for me to not have a pair, but I'll just put that in there for right now. But these are all the boys' clothes. They need a home. Oh, another one. Oh, another one of these bad babies. But two empty laundry baskets, a little bit of laundry done, and the boys are nowhere in sight still, which is good. They're getting their time, and I'm getting to put away laundry without having to answer 87 questions, you know? Ooh, this break, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, buddy. I'm glad you had a good day. Well, kind of, huh? Mm -hmm. On a bright note, guess what? Mm -hmm. Your school has all your papers for your dental and your medical and everything. So, kind of had a tough day after school, but you're all set, okay? Mm -hmm. Miss your lip. Oh, it's not that bad. I love you. <laughs> Sweet dreams, Silas. See you in the morning. Oh my goodness. So Silas is asleep. The twins are... Are you guys done? Yeah. Good job. No. I... no. Yes, no. Mix. I, I have to put away the clothes because he put away five... I have to put away the hangups because he put away five hangups today and he only left me with two. So I have to put away the same... Exact if box. you're not going to sit there and defend yourself, you're stuck doing it. Oh, I, try, I, myself. I try not to get in the middle of the twins. Why is that there? Mm -hmm. You're going to go defend yourself? Mm -hmm. Okay. I try not to get in the middle of the twins. They have to find a happy medium for their chores. They um, they had the free time. They did the, they put away their dishes, but now they have like a quarter, quarter load of laundry to put, to put away, which was mixed in with my laundry. So, but anyway, they're doing that. I have, um, let me show you guys. I have some like brown biker shorts on today with some pockets, which these are absolutely amazing if you guys don't own a pair. But um, <laughs> my sister-in-law, oh my gosh, these kids hang things every which way. Malachi, Jonah, yeah. you guys have to find a happy medium. Otherwise, you guys are going to lose your privileges. You have to talk to each other out of kindness and respect. Finding a happy medium means arguing with your brother, apparently. I try not to get in the middle of it, but sometimes I have to because I have to, like, have my kids watch their tones and whatnot. So, 
anyway, so I was talking, my sister-in-law was like, did you go on a bike ride today? I was like, no, why? She goes, we have biker shorts on. I was like, just because I have biker shorts on does not mean I went on a bike ride today. So that was that. Malachi, off your iPad. Both of you guys clean up your room together. Something happened, I wasn't a part of it from the beginning, so. I try not to get in the middle of it, but today I had to, and it is what it is. Silas's um, solution, here you go. I think you forgot this on the banister. Um, Silas's school thing is behind us now. You have to keep this on. You have to? Yes. Oh my gosh, you're gonna die if you don't. Yes. Video games will not, what are you playing? Minecraft? Mm -hmm. I don't understand it. They have very limited screen time and they cherish it from the bottom of their heart so much to where they feel like they don't have to do laundry. You found a solution? Not really, right? Because I just told them to do it. Wait, where are you going? Get my iPad because he's on my iPad. No, go finish that. Yours is not on pause like his. Oh, have children that have screen time, they said. Holy cow. All right, guys, so back to Silas's thing. His school was, his school was like, oh, thanks for dropping it off, blah, blah, blah. Silas is okay. Um, he's trying not to suck his thumb because I'm afraid that if he sucks his thumb, he's gonna like mess up this part of it. So he's having a hard time with it. But like as a mom of a child that is six that sucks his thumb, I'm like, granted I don't want my child to be hurt. So I'm not coming across in any which way that this might possibly get twisted. I'm like, is this a blessing in disguise that he got hurt and is this okay? I, is this gonna have him stop sucking his thumb because, so he hurt his lip right here. And if he sucks his thumb, it's gonna go right there. So I don't know. Anyway, we'll see. I'm ending this video here, you guys. I wanna say thank you so much for watching today's content. If you loved it, give us a thumbs up, share it out to your friends. Hopefully you guys are following us on Instagram. The link is in the description as always. And that is it for today. I'll see you guys on our next vlog. Bye guys.